Penguin for update. Yes, friends, it's finally happened. Penguin 4 has happened. We waited a long time, but now it's in real time. Yes, Google said this was going to happen, and they finally done it. So, it's now a part of the core algorithm, which is great news, because next time the site is indexed by Google, you can either get some benefits if you've cleaned up your backlinks so if in the past you have been affected by the penguin penalty and assuming you have done some work between that time to clean everything up now you may recover so we'll see as sites get indexed we'll see what happens it might be bad news if you've been building spammy backlinks in the meantime it's possible you could receive a penalty so so it's been a long time, but it finally happened. Penguin 4 has been released as a part of the core algorithm. And here is the announcement from Gary Ilias. So what should you do? Don't panic, of course. Uh, if you've had a penalty in the past, this may help you recover, since it is now in real time, which means Whenever Google crawls and indexes your site, it will also apply the penguin rules of the algorithm. So a few days before the announcement, I was chatting with Omi Sido, and uh, some of his comments included Google's more focused on rank brain, and now that, I mean I tend to agree with Omi, because now that the algorithm has been included, in the core algorithm then yeah, I'm sure they'll just get on with the machine learning stuff. I've uh, chatted with David Iowa now and uh, asked him some comments about the situation and David wrote me back a whole bunch of stuff and some important things here that he said were you know people need to chill on the daily algorithm speculation I totally agree with that. Uh, some wise words there from David. And please, you know, read my blog. There's a whole bunch of stuff here David has said. The next penguin algorithm needs to be able to balance between wiping out the crap but not hurt real websites that just don't have enough time or budget to do link building right. If you are really worried, you're probably doing SEO wrong. So David did a Twitter survey which was quite interesting. Uh, let's have a look at that survey. So this is really quite interesting. But go ahead, take the survey. Get back to focusing on your clients and do the best possible SEO for them. And stop trying to second guess what Google algorithms are going to hit. Yeah, I totally agree. So I can't think of any better advice really than what David has said. Let's get on with the job of doing good quality SEO work that we know delivers good growth. So if you are concerned that you may have suffered as a result of this update, please check your analytics uh, or use a tool such as SEMrush. Here I've got a link to SEMrush uh, which is a huge database of keywords and also has notes about when updates have been done etc. Use a tool such as SEMrush which is a fantastic tool for checking this kind of thing. Uh, if you're not sure ask me I can send you some traffic reports and in the meantime let's get back to doing some SEO to help our business grow.